most of our listeners are on the business side of sports and a lot of them pursuing a career in collegiate athletics at, at varying levels. From a coach's perspective, what advice would you give somebody on the administrative side of a university, given your, your long career in college football? I would say the same thing to them that I would say to young people, you, you better choose your people well. If I'm a director of athletics, I'm a decision maker on letting a coach go or what I think is a bad offensive line coach. Uh, you, you start listening to some of the wrong people or take the wrong path. It, most relationships are about extreme trust all of our relationships. And when you lose it, you know it's going to erode, all right? So I would say that if you're dealing with a coach in a lot of people's lives, before you get to that point, if you start not trusting your your head football coach and you, you want to be a director of athletics, you better address it immediately. In other words, it's got to be make the decision to go ahead and change. Then don't wait and let everything deteriorate because mm. that head football coach, if you trust him with a good, honest conversation, coach, I, I can't tell, but we're having a lot of problems in the secondary. What's your thoughts on our secondary coach? Uh, is there a hole in recruiting that we need to address? I mean, that's a trusting conversation rather than go on the attack mm -hmm. and say, you know, and you, you, you don't really know. And in this era of, a transfer portal, this era of people going pro early, roster management is a nightmare. You can get down in the offensive line and suddenly are going to struggle, and you may have the best offensive line coach in America. And to the untrained eye, well, you just got a bad coach. You know, this guy yeah. was a five-star. This one was a four-star. Well, you know what? Some of those really lit-up stars, aren't as good as advertised sometime either. So it's a complex thing. Don't try to learn the game. That's not your job. Mm -hmm. Try to learn how to communicate. Most organizations deteriorate through bad communication. Same mm -hmm. thing's true in an athletics department. People nowadays, it's become popular to have a sport administrator. Okay, maybe. But if I'm dealing with the big revenue sport, yeah. I don't need an administrator to tell me what's going on. I better be very involved. Old school directors of athletics stayed really close to their basketball coaches and your football coach and baseball coach.